I forgot to have him sign. <laughs> I'm gonna sign right next to Howard Brennan. Yeah, you can do whatever you want. Super duper, I get this one. And what was your name again? Carly, Carly Hattrich. Hattrich, I will not be able to spell. H-A-T-T-R-I-C-H. Do you have a website that has your guys' names and stuff? Yeah, queencityimprov.com. Perfect, then, that, then I can make sure everything's cool. Yep. Oh, the info's there. Not that I never know who's gonna watch it, <laughs> but you know. The big names is what gets the things. Yeah. Awesome. awesome, thanks so much. <laughs> Welcome back, welcome back. Dude, they had theme songs back then. Comedians open cards! Welcome Comedians opening cards, no coffee, and I'm in Manchester, New Hampshire on April Fool's Day at Stark Brewing, and I saw a super awesome improv show from Queen City. Queen City Improv. Improv, and I have two improvers right now, and we are... Aaron Cabana. Carly Hatchridge. Awesome, you guys are great. Thank you so much. Yeah. So, here's what we got, a lot of cards. If you see something that interests you, I just... Think would you like to open the Howard the Duck together? I, uh, I'm glad, yes. I will be happily open a Howard the Duck <laughs> trading <Together>? card. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Now, Howard the Duck has been picked a few different times because I have really? multiples of the decks. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'll be gentle. Yeah. No, um, no, no, no. You get to keep that. I get to keep it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But what I'm saying is, I have like a case of these, so oh, okay. other people have opened Howard the Duck. So oh, okay. I know some information about Howard the Duck, but maybe you know. <laughs> well, I. Oh, really? Okay. Sure. Like inside information about. Well, this is the first Marvel movie. That is true. It's the first did you know that? I did I not know that, that at all. Yeah. 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 The first George, I think George Lucas was like forced to do this movie yeah. too. Was he forced to? Yes. Really? Like after, I think between Star Wars. I and thought it was like I thought George Lucas it was like a comic book that he kept reading and then he just <laughs> said, "Oh, I want to make a movie." I think it was like sort of like he had to make a movie and he chose this movie to make for some reason. Well, I think he like I think, and I'm don't fight over it. <laughs> no matter what you do, going out don't go to blame. I think George Lucas loved the comic book. That's yeah, possible. I, There's also yeah. duck boobs in Howard the Duck, which is very it's exciting. A, it's a very strangely adult. Well, there, the, yeah. What's her name? The the, the oh, actress um, Thompson. Leah Thompson gets in bed with Howard the Duck. Yeah, that's, that's interesting. That's and then, especially for the '80s. Yes. And then the bad guy comes in and breaks it up when they kind of just kiss, and she's in like her panties. But in the comic book version, I don't think he breaks it up so fast. No. But I've never read it. I've never looked into it. You know. You know. She was, she was committed movie. to her. You only have so much time in a movie. You gotta right. Pick one of these cards. Uh, sure. And of course, waterfowl are the only birds that have actual penises. Oh. So, it could theoretically work. <laughs> okay. So, moving. <laughs> so, um, I picked this. You picked the Leah Thompson, Leah Thompson card. card. Right. Well, yeah. yeah, what do you think? Leah Thompson? Mm -hmm. I used to have a crush on her. Sure, a lot she's of people great did. She's back to the future. Yeah, she's very good. Yeah, she's That's the right. mom in yeah. the second one, or maybe even the first one. I guess. No, all three. All three. All three. She's the mom and the... That's the better one. Because, like, she's, like, embracing Howard here. Yes. I think that's a better one. Oh, wow. That is great. That's really <laughs> nice. Lord love a duck. <laughs> I remember the guy in the movie that turned into this huge monster at the towards the end. He's this... Um, the main guy, Je Jeffrey Jones. Is it, is it like, this? No, no, no. It was like this. Um, the actor from Ferris Bueller, Jer uh, Jeffrey Jones, played the principal. Oh, yeah, Bueller. yeah, yeah. He's he's gonna, he, like, he starts, oh, yeah, he's the bad guy in this. He's yes. the bad guy, but he like he turns into the bad creature type of thing, right? Doesn't he turn into a creature? I've never seen the movie. Oh, you haven't? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I don't remember. What did you think that oh, okay. I believe you, though. Yeah, that that's what I remember about the movie. If you went to see it at the movies. I yeah. feel like George Lucas can do no wrong. I wasn't born yet. You yeah. weren't born yet. I wasn't. <laughs> yeah, it like starts off on the duck planet. Yeah. Like yeah. they're all there, yeah. and that's maybe when you see the duck boobs. Yes. Yes. Duck boobs. And then I don't know she how. She has a band. Oh, yeah, there we see. There we got, got the evil principal. There he is. <laughs> yep, yes. Um, and, and Leah Thompson has a band. Dianetics. Um, is that the name of the. That's the I guess name of the That's L. Ron Hubbard. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. so was there something like Scientology? Stuff going it's on with this probably movie? Probably could be. I don't know anything. Well, Travolta's not in it. Mm -hmm. No, or Tom Cruise, but I don't know any behind the scenes info about this. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. And then George Lucas produced it, and I was expecting it to be good. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't think it was good? I mean, you don't I think it deserves it. a remake. It, it, it deserves a remake. 
within the proper Marvel Cinematic Universe. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it is the first Marvel movie. That's pretty interesting. Right. That's an odd fact. fact. Yeah. yeah. You wouldn't think that that would be that one. You know. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But, so, how long you guys have been doing uh, improv? Uh, 2017 is when I jumped, when we started the troupe. Yeah, I I've been I've been with the troupe for about a year. Twenty-seven years. <laughs> Twenty-seven years. Oh my God. Well, it could be. I'm 46 now, so it's yeah, yeah, not yeah. out of the. I've been doing it for like a year. The funny part is, like, I did uh, I took an improv class in college. Oh, like, cool. Way long time ago. Right. And then for like 20 years, I just didn't. I loved it, but then 20 years, I just didn't. Sure. I just didn't do it. I'm like, well, you had other stuff going on. Why? Well, I, I don't know why I didn't just like. Yeah, I just know. You saved it all for Queen City Improv. That's what I mean. It's what probably I mean. easy to take it during school and then after it's like, it, you know, like you then find a group. Yeah, well, I did a lot of theater and acting, but I, improv is so much fun. I mean, theater and acting is too, but like but you, you don't have to learn silly. lines. Exactly. Yeah. It's sillier. How long have you been doing improv? Like, I, like a year. I joined. A year. Oh, you're I joined, brand new. Yeah, when I joined wow. the troupe. That was great. So you oh, had not you. done, you didn't know improv before the audition? No. She had a killer audition. Oh, well, thank you. I guess so. <laughs> That's I mean, why we took her. Right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. No, I love, I love it. Great truth. Yeah, great awesome. people. Yeah. Awesome. So people can see you here at... Um, Stark Brewery. Stark, Stark Brewery. Yep. And also sometimes you said you do Chunkies. For yeah. Chunkies. Yeah, just check out queencityimprov.com. That has... All, all the info. Yes. Awesome. Yep. Thank you so much. Thank Absolutely. you. Have a great night. Thanks. I'm not very aroused right now. Uh, but my name is David Bacon, and yes, everything is better with me. Thanks for asking. Ladies, gentlemen, everything. Okay, Thank thanks, so Dave. Much. Thank <laughs> you.